Johnny Jones is an optimist by nature. So with that in mind, it's no surprise he's feeling confident year two will be better with the Tigers. We have guys that are returning uh, that understand what we're looking for and, and have really adapted. And uh, then we've been able to go out and not just take care of some wants, but really some needs and concerns that we had uh, from a year ago. Now, part of that optimism is who he has coming back. The headliner will be Johnny O'Brien, who toyed with the idea of going pro, but the 6'9 Tiger forward is happy with his move to stay in school. We thought that Johnny continued to improve at the end of the year. Scouts start showing up at our practices and uh, games. Uh, thought Johnny had put himself in position uh, to be a draft pick last year uh, and to come in, uh, say that he enjoyed the year, felt like he'd uh, improved immensely uh, throughout and was looking forward to uh, coming back this year uh, to hopefully uh, with his teammates have an opportunity to improve. Just, you know, um, development, you know, development to the best player I can possibly be. I want to win. You know, that, that's something I really haven't experienced since I've been there. You know, um, I, I definitely think this year with the team we got and how the team is looking, you know, we got, we got the chance to win big. O'Brien returns, and so does one of the most experienced backcourts in point man Anthony Hickey, along with LSU's best three-point shooter in Andre Stringer. Both of those guys are under six foot, uh, but I thought uh, it gave us some exciting moments last year. I would always tell those guys that we can't worry about trying to put their uh, measuring uh, tape uh, from head to toe. We have to make sure that we put it around their heart a uh, night in and night out. And those guys think big and they play big. So LSU knows if they're going to compete with the big boys of the SEC for this trophy. Sure, they have the experience, but Johnny Jones also hauled in quite the recruiting class, a consensus top 10 class. The standouts, how about 6'6 guard Tim Quarterman and standout forward Jarrell Martin. <laughs> One of the areas that I thought we were uh, hurt last year was in terms of rebounding. I think uh, one of the things we were able to do through recruiting was be able to address those needs and uh, with Jarrell Martin and, and uh, yes, uh, with uh, Jordan Mickey, a Dorsey Malone, uh, seven footer, we've been able to uh, put guys in place that we feel will allow us to challenge on the glass again this year. A rock solid recruiting class, a proven batch of starters, could LSU return to the big dance for the first time in five years? Johnny Jones is optimistic. Mike Neighbors for CST Tonight.